Hey everyone, so today is going to kind of be like a little bit different of a video, so I'm going to show you guys just some makeup products that I would use during this wonderful quarantine. Um, obviously, you all are probably like, who wears makeup during the quarantine when you have nowhere to go? I don't. I usually look like this. It's like huge bags under my eyes and stuff, but sometimes you just want to put on a little bit of some something. Today, um, my mom and I are going through a drive through to get coffee and to pick up an online order from Target. Again, normally I still wouldn't wear makeup, but I do have um, a Zoom recording that I have to like post for my entire class to see. So that's why. So I'm gonna show you guys me changing into a different outfit and then putting on a little bit of makeup. So let's get started. So I went ahead and put my hair up. I'm really close to the camera so you guys can see everything. The first product that I'm going to use is this Glossier Skin Perfecting Skin Tint. It literally looks like I'm squeezing it into my hands. My hands are washed. Don't worry. It literally looks like um, that you have nothing on your face when you use it. Like, it really just evens my skin. I never apply makeup with my hands. I just don't do that. It's just not something that I like to do. But with this, it's like kind of nice. So I just do it with this. Sorry, I'm trying to look in my mirror, which is behind my camera. Make sure just to blend up to your hairline and your eyes. That's that. I'm just gonna take Maybelline Fit Me Concealer. My nasty color discolored lids sponge. Just kind of blend it with my sponge. I think I had a hair on me. And then I just add this like Rimmel Stay Matte Powder just to set my under eyes. I barely use any. I just like swirl it in the cap and set my under eyes. I don't really care about, I don't really have to set anything, but um my under eyes but I'm just gonna kind of use the excess and just kind of swirl it around my face again I don't really need to do this this stuff kind of blends in your skin and doesn't really need powder but we're gonna go ahead and just kind of add it so for me I like to do brows a lot of people don't care about their brows um so I'm got out this little bronzer so I can see my brows but I just kind of brush them first and then I use my favorite tint it's this makeup revolutions um, brow tint in ash brown here we go so I just wipe off all of the excess so I don't have like a crazy amount and then I usually just go around my arch let me get closer okay and I actually got some right there but we'll wipe it off That doesn't normally happen. We're going to work with it in a sec. Just do the other side really quickly. Okay, so I am not tan by any means. Like, I'm literally so pale. So maybe I'd add some bronzer if I was tan but I'm not so I'm literally just curling my lashes and then last but not least I'm going to use my Glossier 
um, rose tint lip balm. It doesn't really tint your lips at all, but it's just a nice lip balm. All right. So that is my quick little makeup look. Um, it's literally barely anything. Again, I'm not really going anywhere. I'm just like filming um, a Zoom recording later. Um, but another thing that makes me feel good and put together are my favorite gold hoops. So obviously add those in and then we will go take care of our outfit. I'm gonna show you guys with natural window lighting. Like the makeup, you can still see like my freckles and everything. It just kind of like smooths out your skin. All right, so I am all ready to go. As you guys saw, I put in my little gold hoops. I just have on this gold necklace from Forever 21. Sweatshirt is from Target. Um, I just have on my watch with a black leather watch bands. Rings on my Pandora ring. And then I just have on white Lululemon Wonder Unders and brown rainbow flip flops. So I just feel so much better than before. I actually changed my necklace to this like C one from um, Etsy. And that is kind of how I get ready for, you know, a little going out during this.